Good morning, everyone. Big Box Dave here from Magic the Gathering Attitude. Oh, it's our last Zenharo zero, by the way. That's a zero. Uh, repack. So I, I bought these. These were just under $14. I just confirmed it. I thought it was, I might have been 12 but I looked at it again and it looked like it was $13.90 a pack. And uh, Zenharo's out of these. I bought 10 of these uh, from him. And these haven't been bad. To me, they're just not a NC Jam repack or a, a Ben's Millions for darn sure. The Ben's Million one is the one that uh, Joey Moss opened up. I, I um, forward in that that link. So sorry, there's a lot of tape on these. Just gonna, I don't want to hurt these. But we didn't do too bad last week. We didn't do too bad last week. I pulled out the Wooly, but it, the uh, Wiley Wolf, I should say. I think I don't know how it's pronounced, but the Green Wolf from uh, Arabian Nights. So there you have it. Oh, jeez, man, I got some like pine needles in there. So here we go. All right, uh, Andy Torres, thank you. Let's just go through these. Um, see what we can't find out of here. So I'd like to end this off very nicely. So I've opened three. I've actually, it, 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 he gave me a, I remember when I bought them, he gave me a free, uh, free three pack of them for buying so many. And uh, so I had 13 altogether. And these are my last four. I, I gave uh, some to uh, Neil Torbenner as well. All right, here we go. Let's go through them all. Let's see if we can get all full pull up in here. That's, yeah, there it is right there. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Oh, Girl of Berserkers. Okay, Deepwood Wolverine. By the way, uh, I am currently on my way home <laughs> at this time, or will be at this time, uh, from Cleveland after having visited uh, Michelle, Joey Moss, and uh, Mr. Uh, MTG Game and Bob. So, uh, I hope I had a good time. <laughs> we'll have to see. Okay, revise Frozen Shade. So, yeah, these generally have uh, the, the bomb cards are going to be Arabian Nights, Antiquities, Legends, uh, and I think it was Fallen Empires. I believe that's what it was. Uh, let me check that. Arabian Nights, Legends, Antiquities, and the Dark. Excuse me. So, that could be the bomb card. So, uh, but he obviously has other stuff in here. Like, he has some bulk in here from, from all the other sets. Okay, here come the Uncommons. And for, you, got, you got a Chroma from Onslaught. Okay. Here we go. Ooh, Wave of Heat. That's actually a Chronicles card. Okay. And Death Mark. All right. <laughs> okay, Heroism. Fallen Empires. And White Knight. And that's from uh, Legions. Okay. And Ivory Guardian. That's from, uh, obviously, uh, Chronicles. So... There you go. There you have it. All right, let's see what the uh, see what the bomb cards are. Nope, oh, that's right. I forgot. I forgot he does that. God damn it. Okay, so the first one is Trap Digger, and that is uh, what's that? Not Oblivion. Oh, I forget that set symbol. I forget that set symbol. Ooh, we got Antiquities Artifact Blast. That's actually a decent hit right there from Mark Poole. Not bad. Not bad. I will take that all day long. I have, I haven't. I know, I've seen that card before. I've never owned it. For darn sure. So. Alright. Getting to it. Getting back to it. Alright. Here we go. I do like I do like how we pack these. I will say that. Alright. Here we go. Let's get rid of that. Let's put that down there. Alright. And. Oh. There it is right there. There it is. Alright. And. Oh. My favorite art of all time. I will put that one off to the side. No, it's not an S and M thing. I just, I just like that art. So there you have it. Okay, Armored Pegasus. That's from First Portal. There we go. If anything, like jars my memory. I'll, I'll, I'll talk about it. Alabaster Potion. That's from uh, what's that? Fourth Edition. Yeah, Fourth Edition. <laughs> Torture. Ah, all right. Terror. Love that. One of my favorite removal cards of all time. Orcish Spy. <laughs> he doesn't know what the hell he's doing, man. Doesn't know whether he's coming or going. Right, here we go. Ooh, Terror again. I'll take that. That's from 5th edition. I like Terror. Okay, Portal. I think this is uncommon. Okay, Hulk and Cyclops. That's a big boy right there. 5-5 five, five for 5. Okay, Centaur Glade. Energy Flux. That Was that 4th? Yep, 4th edition. Is it 4th? Yeah, 4th edition. Excuse me. Okay, Death Ward. And uh, that is uh, from uh, Ice Age. And Fatal Mutation. And again, I forget that set symbol, but what was that? 2001? 2003. 
Excuse me. I, I don't know that set symbol. I do apologize, guys. Okay, here it is. Let's see what we get out of here. All right. So, first card is... Ooh, here we go. What is it? Titania Song? That's nice. From uh, Arabian Nights. Very nice. We'll take that. And this is the other one. Okay. There he is right there. Wow. Tanawa. And that's from uh, Mirage. Very, very nice. I do like that card. That is very nice. Anything blue. You guys know that. So, he has Faison. Blue, 7-7 seven, seven for 5. Not bad. Phasing. Not phrasing. Phasing. All right. Here we go. Second to last pack. Let's see if we can get out of here. By the way, there's 35 cards in each pack. So, which is not too bad. Not too bad. Especially, you get a lot of, uh, you get a lot of old bulk in here. So, there you go. All righty. And this, this is just a quick down and dirty, guys. Oh, okay. Guardian Angel. That's from fourth, uh, uh, revised fourth edition. What am I talking about? Okay. And I'm just going through these slowly just so you guys can see them. You know, oh, Twiddle is such an annoying card. I love it, though. So much fun. Sometimes you just build an annoying deck for the sake of a building of an annoying deck. So let me know if you built an annoying deck just, just, just to piss people off. Not to win, just to, like, elongate the game or to make sure that somebody does not win. So those are, like, some of the best games right there. There you have it. Okay, and we get into the uncommons here. Very shortly. Ooh, Mind Ravel. That's very nice. Very nice. I like that. Ooh, okay, here we go. Here's our first uncommon. Okay. So, uh, what is it? Soul Catcher's Arc? Uh, it's airy. Guess what it is. Okay. Ooh, Tunnel. Very well. That's, what, 4th edition? Yeah, 4th edition. Okay. Brass Herald. Okay. Very nice. I have a ton of these guys right here. He's so cute. Look at him. I'm a 4-4. Oh, 4-3 flyer. There we go. That's it. Okay, skull fracture. And ooh, steel artifact. That's unlimited. That's actually not bad. That's actually a good card. I'm gonna put that in the cool guy pile. Anything unlimited. I don't care if it's common or not, does not matter. So unlimited is hot. I love it. So and I do love I do love yeah, steel artifact. Okay. First card. Ooh, Aladdin's ring. Okay. That's that's OG from Arabian Nights. That's a that's a D hit right there. And I'll go over prices on this stuff here in a minute. Okay, oh, yeah, 7th edition. Wow. There it is right there. Visidrex. No kidding. Just a 6-6 six, six stomper for 7. Just not, nothing sexy about him. No flying. Not, none of that crap. So, there you go. All right. Last pack. Aladdin's Ring wasn't bad. Aladdin's Ring is actually pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah, I, I brought this out like when I did Mystery Monday. I was going to rip it out there, but I was like, yeah, you know what? I'll just do it at the house. So, this is last Sunday. So, just to give you guys a heads up. So, if some of the prices don't marry up, that's the reason why. So, I was at a, I was at Walmart the other day. Oh, my God. I bought some of the new new uh, Baldur's Gate product. Went way up in price. I mean, way up. Okay, Prodigal Sorcerer. To the point where I will not be buying any more Walmart product. And they, they, they're like, yeah, that's because, you know, people are stealing stuff. And you have to spend all this money on stealing. Like, dude, put it behind the counter. <laughs> have an associate uh, just just hand it out a little bit at a time or purchase it right there on the spot you don't need all that stuff you know and uh yeah there you, there you go so i was a, i was a little turned off by that cadaverous night again we're, we're approaching the uncommons all right but uh yeah i will be uh very wary going forward with that okay i think wildfire emissary is uncommon I think it is. Almost positive. Okay, Annihilate is definitely uncommon. There you go. Okay, Enrage. Hmm. Okay. Dwarven Catapult. Not bad. That's from that's from the Fallen. Fallen Empires. The Fallen. Crazed Scourge. Sure. An arrogant vampire. I love it. I love it. 4-3 fly. Nothing, nothing sex again, yeah, nothing sexy about it. Nothing sexy about it. Well, it seems like the card on the other side has been kind of the bomb card. Oh, okay. Wow. Possessed Centaur. That's not, that is not bad at all. I will definitely take a Possessed Centaur. So, actually, we'll just flip it. Ooh, okay. Antiquities again. Wow. Argavian Blacksmith. Not bad. Not bad. I believe that's how you pronounce it. Argavian. Ar I thought it was Argavian. But not, not horrible. Not horrible. Beautiful cards. Okay. Hey, guys. Pause for the cause. I'll get a quick... Uh, so basically, I spent uh, four, what's fourteen times three, 
that would be uh, 42. Very good. Okay, awesome. Hey, guys, pause the cost. Okay, and we're back. All right, so for, you know, somewhat good cards, I mean, we are obviously have the Argavian, Blacksmith, Artifact Blast, and uh, uh, Tinawa, which are one, two, and three dollars, uh, respectively. So a new steel artifact was up there. So it's closer to five. It's, it's close to five dollars. So there you have it. There you have it. Okay, Titania Song uh, is an is an eleven dollar reserve list. And Aladdin's Ring. I knew it was. A, I thought this was like maybe around the twenty mark. This is over fifty dollars. I didn't. I didn't realize it was. It was that much. So there you have it. Uh, so bra bravo bravo on the uh, aladdin's ring and it's in good shape too it's actually it, it's it's uh it's got a little play i'd say light play if anything that's just my finger marks on there so uh, 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 uh. Yeah. i don't know why it's doing that probably because it's probably picking up the cards yeah there we go there it is right there so not bad not bad so hey 42 bucks pull about 75 dollars worth of cards all day long, all day long. Uh, it's, so, yeah, this one, this particular one was worth it. Uh, I kind of whiffed out on the first, um, the first little batch, but this one definitely made up for it. So, and he has no more to sell, but it is what it is. And and uh, so, uh, hey, Xandor, thank you, man. So, I, I appreciate the Aladdin's ring. I will uh, safeguard that very nicely. So, until right, guys, listen, hey, real quick, down and dirty. Until next time, much love. I'll see you all tomorrow.